We're at the Hilton uh, protesting the ADS dinner. It's taking place tonight, £230 a head, funded by the sale of arms. The guests arrive for the dinner. I've been reminding them that uh, what they're doing is profiting from, from death. How much is your bonus from profiting from death this year? More Are information about the green thing from the arms trade. Here you go. And so far, who's been protected? So we got in, we, we got, got in, in and we chatted to two different companies. Oh yes! We held our own in a defence type conversation. Yes. And we got handshakes and introductions and everything. Yes. And we went into the ballroom and then I went up onto the stage and I had my speech ready and I was there for quite a long time. Unfortunately, there's no switches on the microphones. And then he came back with four big men <laughs> and I was invited to leave the stage. finest to try and meet the black tie requirements of an arms dealer's dinner. Obviously we couldn't afford the £230 price tag, but wearing black and white seemed to get us far enough to sow a little bit of mischief. I managed to um, hand about 40 leaflets out to arms dealers who were gathered there before they realised what they were receiving, then made my way into the ballroom and left some pictures of the victims of their work on their tables. So hopefully the dinner won't go down quite as well tonight. Then finally I was approached by a guy who was wearing medals around his neck and medals on the side, who asked me to leave. And I asked him not to collude with arms dealers. He kept saying, this is a private function. These people have paid. And I said, well, they've paid with blood money. Subsidised at the cost of our NHS, our education, and our they are making money out of other people's lives and out of people dying and they think that they're great businessmen and they are not great businessmen, they are entirely subsidised by different governments and all they're doing is escalating war and making the situation worse. They are not about defence at all. Their moral ground is non-existent. The people are absolute worms. They're making money out of other people's suffering.